once upon a time a class 5th boy with his class teacher went for a picnic to the lot area the name of that boy was junior junior was very bored being a junior child he wanted to grow up suddenly and he entered into daydreams at the fall of a hat at the lot area he met a fairy the fairy asked junior why are you so sad my boy junior said oh mother fairy i don't like being this young boy that i am i want to grow up very quickly i see the class 8 boy is so happy and i want to grow up can you give me something mother fairy say yeah take this magic ball whenever you want to grow up and want to be transmuted or transported into future you will take a quantum leap just press the ball hard <laughs> I know what the giggles are about. <laughs> what would Junior do? He went back to class and he saw a boring lecture happening and he pressed the ball really hard. And there a quantum leap happened. There he found himself back in class 8. But hey, hang on a moment. His happiness was gone right away because he saw children of class 12 going to the socials, having an iPhone, having a mobile enjoying the life away so he wanted to escape that moment too and guess what he did next time his lecture was happening in class 8 he took out his ball again the ball that the fairy gave he pressed it hard enough and was again transported right from here to here to class 12 but that happiness also didn't last long because he saw children at college now having girlfriends having good freedom and again the magic ball specifically the magic ball he took it out again and pressed it again there he was in his college life not happy again he wanted to earn money he got into a job like this moment after moment any time that he found the present moment not good enough he took out that magic ball again pressed it hard enough and there he was into another future he had a wife he had children now and now he didn't like that too because responsibilities of life are pressing in and there he presses the ball very hard again and he finds himself as a frail old man sitting on the last death bed no more to look forward to and suddenly You know what happened? The teacher of Junior came and slapped him because Junior had not become a old man. He had again entered into a daydream. He was dreaming to be somewhat what he was not. The suspense is loud and clear, and so is my message. Don't worry about the future. Forget about the past. Learn to enjoy the present moment as it is, and we sing the song of peace, and we say a line in that: to take each moment and live in each moment in perfect harmony. Kindly don't leave it up. Thank you, Raj. We, Namaste. Thank you.